Well, hello and welcome back. Thank you for coming back. Today, well, we're in downtown Cato Paport. It's going a little bit dark and Miss Ochi Rasivula Boo is monkeying around. Hello, everybody. How nice to see you again. Our dear, loveliest people in the whole world. All, all of you, every single of you, we're loving you. Too. Are you going to dance? Oh. Ha! Absolutely wonderful. No Absolutely air. spectacular. There isn't much air tonight. There's a little bit of humidity. There we are. There's Mr. Hector, the superstar artist, hard at work. There's oh, Mr. Chris nice. with a mass. Yes, dancing oh, in the spotlights. Yes. What time are you closing? About 10. 10. About 10. So you've got plenty of time to get down here and cross his palm with a little bit of silver. And his friend. Oh, yes. He's yes. waiting to take your money as well. Correct? We live from here where we sell everything. Exactly. <laughs> so they won't be here very long. They'll one be gone in a couple that, of hours. One is that. One Look is that. white. Yeah? Now, the other day, Mr. Chris presented three or four of these to Mr. Boo, and yeah. she actually really likes them, by the way. Yeah. She uses them every morning yes. on the face. Really, really nice. Like and then he offered me one of these. Nice which is a very hard one, and he thought I was very dirty, this is for which I am, but I'm not, if you understand. Right, <laughs> Laboo. Thanks, Mr. Chris. Yes, Laboo. That one was for elephants. For an elephant, yes, it is. Talking about big diggers. Anyway, right, let's get, down. let's get down and see what Mr. Constantinos is doing. Just so you understand what he does, he engraves your name onto a piece of rice, not ice. And the idea behind it is you can get a nice little bracelet in various different colours, as you can see. You can use it as a key ring. Different bracelets there. Pendants. And also he's got this product, which Le Booth likes. Which one did you like, Le Booth? That one? Yeah. It was that one, wasn't it? Yeah, that one yeah, is very, very nice. beautiful, yeah. by the way. Yeah, it's very, very nice. There he is. The superstar himself. Where's Katerina? Katarina, she waits to take money more to come later to take yeah. all together. It's all about <laughs> so money. She's a wise woman. It's not okay, you know. Yeah. You she's like a to take she's wise money. <laughs> Katarina is his beautiful wife, and she comes down here once or twice a day and takes his money, which is wonderful. <laughs> it's absolutely wonderful, and she does. I'm not joking. She does come down in her Marika and me sunglasses, doesn't she? Yeah. Because yeah. she's got a pair of sunglasses with an M and an M. Actually, it was meow meow. Sunglasses. Meow meow sunglasses. You speak yeah, yeah. Chinese. Was a sunglass, she said to me, meow, meow. And you speak Chinese? Meow. <laughs> meow, meow. Meow, meow. You're a cat. Right. Yeah. Just so you understand where we are, there is the harbour cafe on the end, and there is the Sea View gift shop. He's saying hello to you. Was he? There he is. It's Mr. Daniel. You're right, Mr. Daniel. Excellent. Oh, oh, oh. Excellent guy. Superstar. Come on, do it. Here we go. Watch as he does this. This is spectacular. Look at that. So there's three, like, helicopters. They're helicopters, Mr. Daniel, yeah? You call them... Yeah, we've lost one. Yeah. We've lost one. We have lost one. And there's three of them. And then you put them on a catapult and up they go. Where's the other one? We've lost it. He always loses the third one. Go on, Do it again. Go on, Do it again. He's a, a lovely man and he's an absolute superstar and his job is to promote these and those little things there that are running around. See that little thing there that's running around? He also promotes those. There we go, it's off. Scared the living dead outside of it. Right, go on Mr. Daniel, do it again. Watch this. Are we ready? Look at that. Wow. And he always catches them. And they come in a pack of three, which is the problem. You can watch two, but you can never find the third one. And they come in different colours. Blue, yellow, like a pinky colour, green. And that's what it looks like. Yeah. Looks quite simple, but it actually works absolutely wonderful. And they light up. And I can assure you that light stays on for a long time. Because we lost one up that tree over there. And the following night, it was still shining bright. Look at that up in the sky. Look at it. Absolutely fabulous. Absolutely fabulous. Lovely. Thanks, Mr. Daniel. Lovely. Welcome. Lovely guy. Lovely, lovely guy. Uh, and we'll catch him. There we are. There's another one. So that's it. You have a good time as well. We'll see you, Mr. Daniel. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. What have you seen? What have you seen, Leboeuf? Leboeuf has seen something to get 
her hands on and she's going to put some money out of my pocket by the looks of it. Oh, handbags. There we go. That's what she's found, a handbag. Ah. Oh, right. It's time to go. They look quite expensive, so it's time to go. Simon, Jeremy, get down here and save me. I am in terrible, terrible pain. My wallet is suffering. Look at her now. She's begging me to come back in. No, it's not expensive, is it? Which one is it? How much is it? Only 45. Only 45? That's a bargain. Let this lady go past. Only 45. Only, that's a bargain. And do you like it? It's very nice. And do you want it? Yes. Do you want it now? Yes. Right. Unfortunately, I'll have to put my hand in my pocket. Take one out of there then. There you go. Hold on. I love it. Right, okay. There we go. There we are. There's one of them things. We'll give that to that lady. And she'll say thank you very much. Thank you very much. Right. Lovely. We'll go outside because obviously there might be some music playing in the background. There he is. Absolute superstar, he is. Absolute it was superstar. A lovely bag. Yes. And I was dreaming to have that one. Mm. Of course, it's, it's an imagination. Hold on a minute. Look at that. Mr. Daniel in action. And the booths caught it. Absolutely superstar. Absolutely wonderful. Look at that. Ella, come on, let's go and get there. Right, where's your handbag, Lavu? Wait a minute. We have She's going to deliver it to us outside because there's a little bit of music playing in the background inside. It is their shop, understandably. Hold on. Look at that. Boom. Excellent. He's a really, really nice guy. He really, really is. He actually stopped us on the street the other day. You may have noticed in a video and asked us the name of the channel because he liked us and he wanted to subscribe. The booth has got it. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. What's your name? Nadia. 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 Lovely. Thank you very much. Um, Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. So, and the rest. Yes. No, 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 no. The rest. The, the, the rest has to go to the bag. <laughs> yes, go in. Because inside. when you buy the new bag or the bullet, you always have to immediately to put the money. It doesn't matter big or small. Better give them more. <laughs> more. Yeah, I know. But yeah. I've got more, more, I liked you. More. I did like you. Not anymore. <laughs> Thanks very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Right, Carlo, let's get up the promenade and see what's going on. As we can see, Miss Oching Grassivi Labouf is a very, very happy girl. Am I right? Yes. Sir. I'm, well, 50 euros lighter now. Initially it was 45, but now she's robbed me of another 5 euros. So, Jeremy and Simon, if you're watching, just so you understand, if you take this woman to a shop, and if you're stupid, like me, you will end up with no money. It's simple. It's very, very simple. I'll say that again. If you're stupid and you take this woman Come in a on, shop, you will end up with no money. Is it not suiting me? It looks lovely. And come on, it's not the real, but it's real. Well, we understand that it's not actually real. It would have cost me about four and a half thousand euros yeah. if it was real. Yeah. So I suppose I'm quite lucky. Anyway, here we go. There is the Moorings Cafe Restaurant Bar. And to be honest, it serves very good food, nice cocktails, and on top of that, it serves a very nice latte. There's another gift shop called the Blue Memories. And there is the Captain's Bistro, which is a restaurant that applauded Miss Oching Recibi Le Bouffe on Sunday afternoon when she did the Chuchka on the wall at the back, which turned out to be their wall. They didn't care, but they thought it was very funny. So there it is, Captain's Bistro, one of the greatest bistros in the whole of Bafos. Here we go. And we're off up here, so we'll go up this way and see what's going on. We've got another idiot in the background, did you notice that? It's absolutely crazy these people are. So they don't want you to advertise their bars for some reason. Anyway, there we go. There is the Elaine Opticians. And now we come across another gift shop. And this is the gift shop where we actually bought my shoes to go swimming. Yeah, 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 yeah. Very, very nice indeed. So this is a top branded shop, a very upmarket gift shop, and it's called the Borsabella, a very, very nice gift shop indeed, and it's a little bit upmarket if you understand. And as we come along, there's cafes, there's restaurants, there's people, there's hustle, there's bustle, everybody's having a good time, except for the odd one or two miserable bar owners. But hey, this is the way the life goes on. Wow, 
a little bit of fun, people running around, having a good time, drinking, eating. Now, if you look in the sky over there, we can see about 250 lucky people flying in to the Paphos Airport. So that's what those lights are flashing up in the sky. And there's a big, big bird coming in to land. And it's going down into Paphos International Airport, that is for sure. Now, we've got another Gumbaro just up here. His name is Mr. Yanis, and he appears for once not to be talking to a girlfriend. There he is, the superstar known as Mr. Yanis. Yes, sir, you all right? Good? Quiet. Yeah? Yanis is very quiet. Quiet? He has too many people, but he's quiet. Ah, it's a funny day, maybe, is it? Because what is it? No, no. The situation of the war, everything is quiet. Wow. Smile, 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 smile. <laughs> Put a nice spin on it. He does advertise all sorts of things. We're going to walk you. I'm going to walk you around now. So, look at that. He rents these little things, which is like a three wheel motorbike, two at the front and one at the back. And guess what? In a video in the near future, me and Archie and Receiver Labouf are going to get a couple of those and, well, scare the living deadlights out of people, obviously. Now, do you remember that seat in there, Labouf? That's where you got a wet bottom. In white trousers? Yes. It was pretty bad, wasn't it? He's also in cahoots with CY Dive, and he advertises and gets a little bit of commission off them. And then, when we come round here, he's also in cahoots with our Gumbaru, Mr. Tito. Electric scooter. Elvis Pub. There's all sorts of things involved. Elvis Jeep Safari. So he's a really nice guy, and if you book them with him, the price doesn't go up, if you understand. He just gets the commission that anyone else would get. Anyway, back to the bars and restaurants and gift shops and opticians. There we go. So an array of restaurants and bars along the promenade. And to be honest, the Cato Papas promenade is one of the greatest places in the world. It's very calm, it's very tranquil. It's not too busy, but it's busy enough. And it's not too big, but it's big enough. It's difficult to get lost. If you come in with your family, with children, for example, you know, they're not going to get lost. You're going to go, oh, oi, you over there, come over here. Anyway, Lou, what have you got to say? Yes. Well, let me say about my lovely bag. <laughs> so if back to the bag. Right. Normally, my dear women, ladies, <laughs> ladies, listen to me normally. I don't buy it like that. The things, anything I buy, even a needle, I will not buy like that. I will go first, have a look, then come back, and then again and again. What's happened today? I don't really know. I went into the shop and I fall in love immediately from the first sight. And then, because I don't have money on me, Mr. Paul was right there where I needed him to Can be. I interrupt you? That's where Booth is very clever. She never, ever, ever carries money. She's like Rolton. Yeah, well, that's why I have a gentleman, the real one, who's always <laughs> nearby me. And I fall in love. I think you understand me. And I never had such a bag before. Right. Lovely. There we go. Very clever woman. She's, I'm only joking, but she's very, very manipulative. Very good with the compliments. <laughs> and normally gets whatever she wants. Hold on a minute. Let's stop right here. Because that shop, which is a diamond shop, appears oh, to oh. be open. And that's not a good idea. Right. Miss Oching, we'll see you in a booth. Let's have a very, very big goodbye. I will tell you a very, very, very big goodbye. Thank you for watching us. Many thanks for being with us and staying with us as long as you can. We're loving you to be And come back again to see some other of our madnesses. We love you. All that's left for me to say is thanks for watching. And if you like what you see, please hit the like, click subscribe, and come back for some more of our madness. I will pan around and show you the spectacality of the Cato Papas promenade with the lights flickering and people walking around and that sort of thing. There we go. And the Sochi and Receiver the Booth is there as well. Change the task. Don't yes. lose no, orientation. No. The diamond no. shop is there. The diamond shop is no. there. There we go. Terrible um, place. Absolute terrible place. It's a terrible place to go. Yeah, yeah. No, right. no, no. Thanks for watching. No, no. It's okay. It's okay.